On the streets of Hong Kong, it is difficult to find anyone not wearing masks. With the memory of being one of the worst hit cities during the 2003 SARS epidemic, most residents are not taking any chances. But many of them are running out of face masks fast. These people have been here since early morning. Cosmetics chain Bonjour announced on Thursday it is rationing 2,000 boxes of masks. Store staff hand out quota tickets from the start of the line, allowing each person to buy two packs. But many are leaving empty-handed. Today we have a quota of 410 masks. We are trying our best to keep the supply stable. I queued for two more hours after I reached the quota. Hong Kong's chief secretary, Matthew Chang Kin Jong, said over 32 million masks are being shipped to the city. And other officials have said that the government is sourcing masks from over 140 suppliers in about 10 countries. But in other parts of Hong Kong, the current shortage has angered some residents. Adding to the concerns over public health, a medical worker union is threatening to strike next Monday, unless the government completely shuts down the border with the Chinese mainland. It's a request Chief Executive Carrie Lam denied, citing advice given by the World Health Organization for the decision. The majority of Hong Kong's face mask supply come from the Chinese mainland, and as the country's manufacturers are still trying to cope with the dramatic upsurge in demands, this will likely remain a daily sight for the days to come. Yang Chengxi, CGTN, Hong Kong.